describes how to use the ACD Labs iLab interface to generate names from structures. On the left hand side, we see that the naming module is seen here. And just to the right of it, we have options for uh, importing or drawing the actual structure itself. Whether you want to open up a drawing interface or simply looking it up in our dictionary, which has over 160,000 names, you can import or upload a file, uh, whether it's a mole file or a chem sketch file, copy and paste, or empty or enter a smiles notation. What I'm going to do is just simply copy and paste from a uh, from a chem sketch window. Now you can do the same from a chem draw or an ISIS draw window. And what it does is, as soon as you import the structure, it calculates some discount properties. But as soon as you click on the IUPAC name, it will generate the IUPAC uh, name of the structure itself. Now, this is the IUPAC name. And within the interface, we have the option of setting certain parameters. And again, these all follow the IUPAC convention. Our uh, naming uh, algorithm is the gold standard uh, within the uh, within industry as our main developer is part of the IUPAC naming committee. Now there are some limitations to a number of atoms that uh, can be observed within the structure. So as long as the structure itself has no more than 255 heavy atoms, so excluding hydrogens, uh, our software will be able to generate a, uh, a correct name for it. Now, if you click on the index name, again, it will generate the index name. Uh, it could be different from the IUPAC name. And again, there are some rules that can be applied uh, to generate the, the index name itself. Again, we have the ability to generate uh, names, <coughs> to generate structures from names, simply by clicking on the name to structure module seen here. What I'm going to do is just copy and paste the name and place it into this line and click on get structure. As soon as it says get structure, it will generate uh, a structure based on the, uh, on the name that you have entered. Again, you can actually download this structure, whether it's uh, in a mole file, simply by clicking on download, or you can copy and paste the structure and paste it into a Word document or a um, or another uh, drawing module, as well as you can download a report. So basically it has a PDF file with the structure and the name uh, of this particular compound. If you want some more information about the drawing module, you can simply click on the help icon. And again, it gives you some more information with regard to the, uh, the name to structure uh, help, uh, help menu. Or if you go back to the IUPAC name, and again, there are some more uh, information with regard to the IUPAC uh, conventions that are used. So this short video described how to use the ACD Labs iLab interface to generate IUPAC names, as well as the ability to generate structures from names.